uh, this is unit 2 of module 6 dealing with family business uh, let's look at the con uh, cultural context of uh, family business family business are one of the dominant entrepreneurial forces in today's global economy but with poor survival rate probably due to conflict in fact is one of the earliest form of uh, uh, businesses before corporate adventure of uh, uh, corporate organizations family businesses are the part of the oldest type of uh, business or organizations and uh, sometimes people look at it as a arena of uh, uh, exploitation why because uh, sometimes there are inequity in the line of family business because it has a lot of uh, exploitation because progression sometimes are based on, on on age on seniority it's not as if the best the best person because the all the conflict that arise in family business they are really human conflict sometimes you see somebody that is an expert in the field if it is father and the immediate family it's the first son that is usually take uh, over the business not even the, the daughters don't come in it's the first son and sometimes you get a first son that is an imbecile and the second son may have something of his sleeve but because he's not the first one if you give him the the, the responsibility it may ruin the business and the, the the fact that you now have a business becomes a source of worry a source of sorrow so in the family business because of this uh, traditional and cultural uh, issue of uh, inheritance there is a, a lot of uh, conflict sometimes there is a inequality lines concerning the gender issue a disability and age uh, including other social categories these are the areas that make family business more complex and uh, more problematic so when looking at uh, you know family business family culture and tradition are usually deployed to invoke positive uh, association and when you invoke it uh, uh, definitely most of the time because the the cultural issue traditional issues are involved it's easy to invoke but most of the time it doesn't do well it doesn't farewell for the businesses itself so but uh, uh, the people that own the business uh, the issue is that could they set aside tradition in order to fulfill the the uh, organizational quest for success for the survival of the organization but these are the complex uh, issues that they uh, arise in family business but uh, as we can as we have observed in many businesses you know they can sacrifice expertise knowledge in order to uphold the family uh, culture and uh, tradition because they do that in order to uh, elicit uh, unity uh, integration and uh, harmony and the loyalty in the business they keep going collectively just for their own sake for the sake of tradition and for them the sake of common good we'll stop here for now